now i'll just click here for undeformed shape and after that i'll just select all of them and i'll go here in that option share all design or here in design option then here share all design clear after that we have to go assign power section okay assign power section and after that there are three methods so first of all i'll show you about that method simplified c and t design i'll just click on it okay after that when this okay after that i'll just go again uh, from here or here i can go i'll just go here and from there i'll just go here revest pair overrides i'll click here and we'll check that our method is okay or not so pair section type simply put tension and compression method design and design is seismic you have to select yes or no so we'll design for seismic load and after that materials you have to select the materials which material you are using and also the thickness bottom then uh here also top thickness and bottom length of bottom and top length and if you need that boundary element value if you it's i mean if your val value is pre-calculated then you can add here otherwise no need okay so i'll leave it default i'll click here okay it's done when it's done now i'll click here and i'll go a start design check so I'll click here and see what happened so if i zoom that okay so if i zoom that and if i go for top now we are seeing that for our left side and right side value if i just right click here we will get a detailed design value and for left top and right top here we are seeing that our river area and here also left bottom and right bottom here is our river area clear and here its length 10 inch its length 10 inch okay so here for flexular design we get our actually this is for flexular design tension reinforcement this is for tension reinforcement and flexural design for compression reinforcement and all the top level we record okay left top and right top we record reinforcement for our compression value and here the boundary element check okay boundary element check you are seeing that for our top left and top right and bottom right we record its length for boundary element for 5 inch 5 inch and 5 inch and but but for uh, bottom left no required for that value okay and here c value of c depth in 10 inch 10 inch and 10 inch clear and c uh, limit in here so you can see that the critical or critical depth and limit also right i'll just close it and if you just go top and here if i right click here okay so for that portion no requirement for uh tension and reinforcement okay also so i'll just close it but overall in overall distance we will provide the maximum reinforcement where we are providing clear